morning, friends. So, last night was the national championship and it did not go the way we had hoped. But, have coffee. Does that make it better? Yeah, a little bit. Um, I did enjoy seeing the relationship between Kirby Smart and Nick Saban. That was kind of fun to watch. And Kirby Smart has coached with Saban for years and was at Alabama. So certainly he learned a few things along the way. But I'm glad that, well, I'm not glad. I am happy for Kirby. Let's just put that way. Okay. If my husband sees this, he'll be mad. <laughs> um, we need coffee and I need something to stir my coffee with, with my creamer. And it's overflowing. I put it in my Yeti cup because that's what was there. And the problem with the Yeti cup is it makes it too hot. I don't like hot coffee. I like it like lukewarm and it's going to be burning my mouth. That's one thing the Yeti does is keep my coffee warm. So it is like filled to the brim, but I don't have enough creamer. Good morning. Oh, the kids made uh, a sign. <laughs> I don't know that you can see it. Uh -huh. For last night, it says, let's go Bama and Alabama A's. And it's like on a little, they made like a sign to go E. That was cute. Okay, so it is a Tuesday. Normally, um, we would start back our homeschool co-op today, but we're not doing that. We're postponing it for another week because of like COVID exposures and tummy bugs and sickness and all that kind of stuff. Um, over the fall, we didn't, I don't think we missed any like as a collective group for any of that. Now, families would miss and stuff because they were sick, but. And then, um, I'm not sure since we're not going to go up today, I'm not sure what we will do or accomplish. I think I will probably try to get some more um, clear done. Not sure. I know I need to go change diapers because um, we just woke up. So let me go get diapers taken care of. Okay, I'm going to try to find something for the kids to watch because they want to watch stuff. Did I turn the TV off? What was that off of? Disney Plus? So I have not gone to the grocery store this year. It's January 11th and I haven't been to the grocery store yet. Now I probably could go a long time without going to the grocery store. We have plenty of food, but we do need things like um, milk. You know, that one $3 milk will turn into $100 of whatever stuff or more. Um, so I know I need to um, meal plan and get a Walmart pickup. Now the Sam's Club pickup is pretty much stuff I just want to have, need to have, not not need. And it's, I think, 250-ish. But we spent way too much money last week eating out, like way too much money. And I need to fix that with some groceries in the house. We are actually, the week ended up being, so I we've been having like back-to-back -back weeks of like the craziest busy weeks we've ever had. And um, this week was crazy busy, but with our homeschool co-op postponing till next week, that kind of saves some stuff. Instead of having like cheer practice and a game, we just have a game. Um, it is my birthday week, y'all. At the end, it's Sunday, so. Um, but it's gonna be a whole birthday week and probably a whole next birthday week because then after that, I get um, my teeth taken out and then it's Emma's birthday, so. Um, 
I mean, a birthday should be longer than a day. Like, normally I have a birthday month. <laughs> but, um, so the week is turning out different than what I had thought. And we're gonna go back to Oklahoma and work with Wayne and take him, that's our horse, um, take him over there and work. We don't have class, so a lot of shakes, shakeups this week. But I'm going to get my planner out and play. Oh, actually, this came. I'm gonna open this. I think this is my. I just ordered some more, but I think this because it's heavy. I think it's my February kit, which is I'm super excited about because I also have some of the clip art for this, so I might make some stuff for myself. Um, maybe even in my shop, but it's the pattern that I have for Maggie's birthday. I mean, Maggie's um, bedding. So, very excited. Oh, and I have stuff from Hobby Lobby that sh matches. I need to, I need to pull all those things out, but let's open this. It's fun. Okay, all the kids are up. That's frozen. And I am making them some breakfast. Um, we're having toast. And let me show you this bread. It's really good. Y'all, I keep it simple around here. Okay, this day's pillar bread, good seed, is just, is really good. Protein, fiber, and like, look at those omegas. Um, and whole grains, like, it's really good. I just put butter on it. And then get, um, some more that. Um, but the other kids want white bread and I'm doing cinnamon sugar and then I'll cut off the crust for them. Do you see that? That's water. I'm assuming the dishwasher is not draining properly. Well the day took some turns and we were gonna have a cheer game tonight or a basketball game that we were gonna cheer at tonight. Um, oh yeah, cause I'm the new cheer coach for my girls cheer team. <laughs> um, but that got canceled because of sickness. So we are not doing that anymore and we're just going to enjoy a quiet night at the house. This whole week has seemed to be cancel, 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 cancel all week long. Um, but after the week I had last week, I'm okay with that. Honestly, mama needs some rest. She needs to clean her house. And I have been spending so much time, uh, doing Bible study today and I've really enjoyed it. Probably have been neglecting some other things. See, I'm still in pajamas, um, but I'll show you, uh, some of my notes that I took and, um, we'll see how the... I'll show you some of my notes. So I have um, all of these. I've been, um, let me show you. So computer, computer. Um, I'm reading this, the Bible recap. Recap. So I'm reading this, the Bible recap. Um, I'm using, well, it's not really showing. I'm using, um, the Bible app. Do you guys know what that is? The Bible recap, which is right here. Let it, let it load. They have a podcast that's really good. Um, and then they have some notes and I've been looking up scriptures, but I've- Hey, go on, can I leave I please? All right, Lydia's over here making puppy chow. I don't know. Shake it, show. I'm just showing the bag. Puppy chow, making a mess. Oh um, well, I, I need a mess. Well, I need it cleaned up. Have I made a mess? Uh, Mark called, and we are going to make fried rice, chicken fried rice tonight, and dumplings, and um, crab rangoons. Basically, what is it called? Like Chinese chicken, Chinese stuff. Ooh! What are you doing? Do you got a celery? 
She came around that corner all funny like. Yeah, it's all stuck on the bottom. Okay, um, I am going to make some rice real quick. Okay, Mark just called and we decided we are going to do chicken fried rice for dinner. So I am going to go ahead and boil up the rice and get that going. It's four o'clock. So the key to good fried rice is supposedly cooling it. Um, don't know if that's actually going to happen or not, but we'll be ahead of the game because it'll take a while to cook it up. So I'm going to go boil the rice. Rice, and I always do two to one. Stop, Liv. I have um, rice. We're gonna bring this to a boil. So what I did is I have this handy measuring cup. Oh, I think it's in here. Um, I think it is two cups. Is that two? I can't see. Yes, two cups. So I do two of these of water and one of these of rice. And that's how I do my proportions ratios, whatever you want to call it. Um, this time I put a tablespoon of um, this bouillon flavor in here to, I did actually three teaspoons, makes a tablespoon, and um, put it in one of the two cups of water. So I probably could have done more, but I am going to bring this to a boil and then I'm going to reduce the heat and let it simmer with the lid on. So that's what we're gonna do there. Um, finding a lid will be the hard part. I don't know if y'all's uh, cabinets look like mine, but probably, I mean, ugh. maybe, maybe not. That's too big. Okay, no, not that one. We have a very tiny kitchen, but I have a kitchen, so I am supposed to be thinking. Oh, it doesn't fit either. Okay. I'm really not seeing the one that fits. Oh, look at y'all. I found a stash of candy. Um, this one's too small. maybe two minutes like that and then I'll turn down the heat. What you doing with that passy? <laughs> okay, filling up ice chests. Seeing how that was empty. I'm gonna refill it. We dump it in here so we can still get it in the door but we have to do ice chests and I should put you down so I don't spill water everywhere. Okay, Mark came home and I've gotten a lot done. He got some chow mein noodles, a rotisserie chicken that I just pulled apart, saved this to make um, chicken stock with. I just washed those eggs and over here we have cooked rice um, kind of cooling. So we'll start making that. I'm also gonna try to make a salad dressing like that you would get at the Japanese restaurant. We'll see. my own sauce with a whole bunch of things um, and I kind of just make it until it tastes good.
Except he got her. You try. No. No. It's my rope. You said we don't rope people. No, how you hold it. Is <laughs> that how you hold it? You just this. threw it at it. <laughs> He's like, you yeah. Did you just kick her? Keep party, so you're in the way. Watch out, Rick. That's not how you hold it. Hey. That's not how you hold it. <laughs> you are coming, Rick. Why are you? Why does it have to be that big? It's easy the bigger to it is. Shorter than it is. Shorter than it is. That wasn't me. You're just like smacking it. I just had to clean enough rope to rope timber. You're holding it wrong. <laughs> you're holding it wrong. You're, you're gonna hit the fence. You're gonna. John Luke, why don't you let John Luke show you how to do it? Or better yet, let Rhett, because Rhett's awesome. What are you doing? Holding it wrong. You're holding it wrong. Wow, you can't even do it. And then you pull it sideways. Boom, burn it. You're very hot. Rip legs. Stop. It's not tied down. What are you talking about? <laughs> when you rope the head first, then they pull it sideways like this, so the legs kick out, so the back guy, the healer, can go whoop and get the yeah. legs. Dad. And stretch out the spring. Dad. Oh, don't rope the baby. I'll get head, you get heel, bud. The baby's in the way. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm Maggie. Cooler. I mean, so can get the baby <laughs> Where do you want to be? Will you want to be header? Yes. Oh, I'll be healing. Yes. Mm. I wanna... And where's Rhett? Back there crying Rhett in his Mears. big boy underwears? Yep. I just found it. Quiet. Quiet in the peanut gallery. There's not enough room in here for this. Can you do it this rope's not good. It's a stiff rope. No, it's literally fine. I don't like it. <laughs> what is Maggie doing? <laughs> The baby was Kimber. hugging the bull. Kimber, leave Kimber. Well, whatever. Everybody has a rope now. We're not supposed to ride it. I didn't get on it. I was standing Sure you were. That's not how you rope it, John Luke. Ooh, Brett, your shirt's on backwards. Uh, <laughs> what was that? You have to watch it when he kicks his legs oh, up. Yeah. That's chance. Oh my gosh. You have to go. You have to throw it down and pull it. Okay. okay, so me and Snugglebug are ready oh. to go to bed. And um, I'm placing a Sands Club and Walmart pickup. Um day 12 of the month and well mark went today and got a couple of things he got milk but so i'm getting some other things but can you tell everyone bye max say bye mm. bye friends see you in the next video thanks for stopping by today if you enjoyed this video give it a like and hit that subscribe button we'll see you later